but if any of you have it, please delete it. Otherwise, if we discover that video on any student, he or she will be expelled from college. Now the story two weeks ago is shown, how did it all begin? Marina, who was she? She was fond of Facebook and spends her most of time while uploading pictures or videos on Facebook. She even uploads the picture of a small thing that is happening in her life. Well, Marina is shown who just joined the college and Laura sees Marina when she was sitting with her friends. She was sitting alone and watching her. After it, Laura returns home and starts using Facebook again then she notices a friend request. Someone has texted her to be friends and that was from the new girl Marina. Laura begins to see her account, she has no friends, and Marina has uploaded strange pictures to her account. Those pictures were giving clue of black magic, but instead of all this, Laura makes friendship with her. The next day, Laura meets Marina, where they talk and after it, Marina thinks now they are good friends. She starts messaging Laura, but she keeps on messaging her even she wasn't replying. Laura becomes worried because of all this and Marina started behaving strangely. When Laura did not respond, she continued to call her. It was Laura's birthday the next day and she was getting ready for the party. Meanwhile, Marina video calls her and this time, she receives her call. Marina wishes her birthday and asks her can she come to her birthday party? Laura does not want Marina to attend her birthday party because her friends dislike Marina for being strange. She lies to Marina that this time she didn't arrange a party and will just spend time with her special friend. Then she moves with her friends for a party while disconnecting the call. Everyone was happy and take pictures together in the party and upload them on the Facebook. Marina sees those pictures and feels bad as Laura didn't invite her to the party and lied to her. The next day, Marina meets Laura in the college and asks why she didn't invite her on the party. I have made a gift for you and it took two weeks to make it but Laura replies it's been few days we met. So, how have you been making gifts for me for the past two weeks? Here, we discover Marina was stalking Laura on Facebook for two weeks. They start arguing now and the cap from Marina's head falls off. She has no hairs and looking strange. That's why she used to wear a cap always. Everyone was shocked to see a Marina in this state, and she felt embarrassed as a result, so she left. Laura unfriends Marina means now they are no more friends on Facebook. As a result, Marina's friend count drops to zero, indicating that she no longer has any Facebook friends, which she dislikes. She becomes depressed and begins to cry before abruptly shutting down her laptop in rage. After it, the present time is shown where Laura gets panicked to hear that Marina has ended herself. And she blames herself for this but her friends make her understand, don't worry there isn't your fault in it. After it, they move to their homes, the same night Laura was sleeping and then receives a message from Marina. She becomes surprised to see her message because Marina was dead. Then she turns her laptop on and sees the message. It was a video in which it is shown how Marina has ended herself. She has performed a ritual means black magic before ending herself. In which firstly, she burnt Laura's picture and then put herself to death on it. She gets scared to see the video but Laura's friend consoles her and tries to delete the video but it wasn't deleting. A surprising scene is shown the next day, someone has uploaded Marina's video on Laura's account. None discovers who has done this means who has uploaded this video. Laura again tries to remove the video from her account but it wasn't deleting at any cost. Then she tries to delete her account but she couldn't. Now the video comes in front of everyone and they suspect Laura because Marina burnt her picture before dying. The police investigates Laura, but she says I don't know anything about it. And I also tried to delete that video but it isn't deleting. Now Laura reaches a hacker for help who knows internet very well. He tries to delete that video but he also couldn't and Laura has to leave. But the hacker checks her account that where the problem is? Why that video isn't deleting? Meanwhile, a friend of Laura is shown talking to someone on call but suddenly, the call disconnects. 
and he discovers his phone isn't working when he checks. With it, he starts feeling strange things in his house. Suddenly, the light goes out, and because of the strange voices, he becomes terrified and moves to the lift to leave his house. There was a massive beehive in the lift, which was obviously unusual and out of the ordinary. His fear increases. We couldn't see what happened next, but we did see Laura's friend right after. She comes to meet Laura's friend who was in the lift. But she becomes astonished as she opens the lift because she finds her friend hitting his head hard in the lift. His condition wasn't well, it seems like someone has controlled him. And he has made himself injured that he dies in front of his friend. Laura's friend becomes panicked to see this and gets faint, then she finds herself in a hospital when she awakes. Her friends including Laura come to meet her and she was staring at Laura and says this happened because of you. Her friends make her understand there isn't Laura's fault in it. After all this, Laura considers herself responsible for everything. But her friend makes her understand why are you worrying? Nothing has happened because of you. He leaves for his job after making her understand. Laura receives a message after a short time and she sees someone has uploaded the video of her friend who died in the lift. She tries to delete that video but again this time the video wasn't deleting. It is obvious that Laura was under suspicion because of all this so she tries to delete her account but she couldn't. Now Laura was suspended from the college for a few days because of the videos on her account. After it, Laura moves to that hacker and he tells we will delete Marina's account if we will get her laptop. The videos in your account will also be deleted when we will delete her account and everything will be fine. Now they go to that room where Marina has ended herself for taking her laptop. And they find many strange and terrible paintings there while finding the laptop. They find Marina's childhood picture of her school. The faces of two people were ruined in the picture, and Laura understands that the happenings to her isn't normal. She goes to Marina's childhood school to find more about Marina. And when she inquires the principal tells Marina was a weird girl since her childhood and everyone was scared of her. She has seen bad time in her childhood and bear many tortures that's why she remains silent and separate from everyone. She has learned and seen things on the internet at a young age that she should not have learned or seen. The hacker is shown seeing Marina's account and discovers there is just one word written on every picture of Marina. Black Mirror, then he writes Black Mirror on internet and tries to discover about it. He discovers Black Mirror is a ritual of black magic that can be performed through a special Black Mirror. The person performing black magic shows the picture of the person from whom he or she has to take revenge, then put himself to death after burning that person's picture. Now because of this black magic the human who wanted to take revenge doesn't die but changes into devil. The task of the person starts after changing into devil, get their powers and using them they take their revenge. The hacker also becomes surprised to know this. Laura's friend is shown playing game but then her phone turns off. She feels someone's presence and hear terrible voices and finds the dead bodies of the patients in a weird condition. It seems they are rotten, she gets scared to see all this and then runs in the hospital for taking help. The hospital was deserted and there was none for her help, she feels someone is behind her and wants to end her. That's why she hides in a room and finds her own dead body there in a bad condition. Her eye had been opened, and her neck had been injured and was bleeding. She become panicked to see this and then hears the voices of many bees and finds a huge beehive when she checks. Suddenly, the bees attack her in a crowd and start moving inside her mouth and she feels weird in her throat. She cuts her neck to get rid from all this and dies. After it, someone uploads her death video on Laura's account. She couldn't delete that video like always. Now the hacker tells Laura about the black mirror and black magic and says Marina has performed this black magic. She didn't die and has become a devil and now she is taking revenge from all of us. Now it starts happening strange to Laura's sister, her condition gets worse. And she was seeing repeatedly that how her friend died who has cut her neck. 
Her devices start working automatically due to it. She gets scared and tell Laura that she isn't feeling well and going out. Laura starts telling her friend about the black magic and her friend investigates more about Marina. He discovers Marina's mother worked in a hospital and she died badly being burnt because their house caught fire. It was close to the birth of Marina and the doctors have saved her somehow but couldn't save her mother. They were talking meanwhile, they notice the face of Laura's sister turns strange. It means she is the next person to die. Now they move to save her and then the strange thing starts happening to Laura's sister. Laura's sister falls on their car when Laura and Laura's friend reach to bring her. She doesn't die but becomes injured badly so Laura takes her to the hospital. Then she leaves for the hospital where Marina's mother work with the hacker while asking her friend to take care of her sister. Because Marina's devil enters Laura's sister, she loses control. Then, in a fit of rage, she snatches a gun from an officer and shoots herself. The hacker receives a message when they reach there and the hacker checks and there was a black mirror on his cell screen. And he immediately understands that he is the next person to die. Laura also realizes that Marina's mother did not die of burns and was also practicing black magic. The hacker also understands Laura is the reason for the happenings with them and Laura will become a devil if he will end her. Likewise, Marina will get her friend and she will not end others. Now the hacker tries to end Laura, but she somehow runs from there while escaping. After it, Laura receives her friend's call and he asks where is she? Tell me hurry up I am also coming there. Laura tells him I am in the hospital where Marina's mother worked. He immediately reaches there and meets the hacker who told him everything. But Laura's friend ignores him and asks him to wait for them while staying here. I'll just come after taking Laura. He leaves in search of Laura after saying this. He finds her after some time but she was scared so he hugs her. Getting a chance from it, the hacker attacks Laura's friend with a knife and ends him. Then he moves forward to end Laura but she runs from there while escaping. And while running, she comes to a point where there is no way forward. The hacker also reaches here and moves forward to end her. But suddenly, there was someone's presence and many bees gather and surround the hacker. They start biting him and even moving inside his mouth. And the bees make his condition worse that he dies immediately. Laura has lost courage here, which means I will not be able to flee, and it is now my turn to die. Her friends and even her sister were ended and then Marina's devil comes in front of her. Laura asks what do you want from me? She says I just wanted to be your friend. Now the devil takes Laura in front of the black mirror and seeing her sh-